welcome back to Mission in the Kitchen. It's Ashton Samuelson with Tacos for Life. And if you love high quality, really delicious cold coffee that you are gonna make at home in less than 30 minutes, stay tuned, because you're gonna love it. I'm so excited about today. I have Tori Cochran with me here from West Rock Coffee, and we show you all the amazing, wonderful things that they're doing with their lives. And so we're gonna talk about the mission of West Rock and how phenomenal it is and the impact they're making in people's lives all around the world and how we can become a part of that mission. And so first, we're going to learn how to make this amazing cold coffee at our house. You can do it. If you know nothing about how to make coffee, you are about to become a coffee connoisseur. Today, we're gonna to be using West Rock's Mesa. Okay. I've actually pre-measured um, just six ounces. Thank you. Okay. You are gonna take just two pictures, or even if you don't have two, one and one. Okay. The first one is just your room temperature water. Perfect, and that's just something out of the tap. Get it out of the tap, room temperature water. I would pour that one in first. You've got your second one. This is just boiling water. And then you wanna let it sit. This is the hard part. You let it sit for 15 minutes. That's not bad though. <laughs> so, in the pouring, all we've done is take in just your everyday brew, brew basket. basket. I'm just gonna stick this over here. Perfect, and do a little pour. And do a little pour. And it seems so easy. It is so easy. We're done. The All stuff that you have is we're just continuing to pour. It's amazing. Now it's the time to present it. What do we do? To taste it. It's done. So add ice to whatever your favorite cup is. I love it. Pour a desired amount of cold coffee. How fancy are you feeling today? Girl, I'm feeling real fancy. Really? It looks so good. Actually, are you getting this? <laughs> that we're so excited about sharing with you. So Tori, tell us about your mission as a company, what, what that means, how our, our viewers and our friends are gonna be able to take part in that just by purchasing your company. So you guys heard me allude to Mesa being near and dear to our hearts because it does have East African coffee in it. It's got coffee from Rwanda, which is where our origin story, story starts about 11 years ago. Okay. Um, I had just the great opportunity of being at the company for 11 years. Mm -hmm. And back in the day when we started, it started with the mission of reaching farmers, uh, mm -hmm. telling their story, um, going to a country, Rwanda, that was genocide torn and saying, hey, how can we teach a man to fish? Not just give him fish, but how can we come in and help the farmer, ask what their needs were, meet those needs, um, instead of coming in with a cookie cutter formula. Yeah. And, um, and we've done that over a multitude of different uh, venues or avenues. Mm. From our origin story in Rwanda, we've expanded around the world into 25 other countries. So in those 25 countries, we want to make sure that we're transparent. Mm. What is the transparency of products, of price, mm. of farmer? that it's traceable. Can you trace each bean that goes into this into the farmer and the hands that prepared it for you? Mm. And then of course sustainable. How do we make sure that the farmers that we partner with are being sustainable for mm. our kids? For sure. And we all want to be a part of something bigger. So that's the best part. You can enjoy something at home now with this delicious coffee and you can feel amazing about it knowing that you're empowering a farmer. Buy yourself some West Rock coffee, make yourself this delicious drink in less than 30 minutes and feel great about making a huge impact. Not only as you drink your coffee, as you eat your tacos, but just being you. And I hope this video has encouraged you and reminding you that there is good things happening in our world and it's worth celebrating. So I hope you have a great day. Thank you, Tori. Thank you. And we'll see you guys next time in Mission in the Kitchen. Bye.